This to bring it back to two points. He's done it! Kurno goes bang! What's going on, Godzilla Nation? This is our Godzilla. We are back with some more AFL Evolution Fantasy Series. Thank you for joining me, as always. This week, we are taking on North Melbourne. Last round, we took on Sydney. They gave us a run for our money for three quarters, but Richmond managed to get over the line by a comfortable margin. I'm expecting North Melbourne to put up just as much of a fight. First placed sixth. Having a look at the ladder, Richmond on top ahead by one win. Port Adelaide, Collingwood and Melbourne round out the top four. Geelong, North Melbourne, the Bulldogs and Hawthorne round out the top eight. Gold Coast Suns, Sydney Swans, Carlton and Fremantle all tied for that seventh spot. But out of the eight, West Coast, St Kilda, GWS, Adelaide, Brisbane and Essendon. Rounding out the rest of the ladder. Having a look here. Jaeger O'Meara still has one more match to serve for his high contact. Injury wise. We have a clean bill of health. We're ready to get this match underway. But before we do so. If you guys have been enjoying this. Be sure to leave a like on the video. It goes a long way to supporting myself in this channel. And I cannot thank you guys enough. For all that support. But I think. Without further ado, it is time for us to get this match underway. Who is the captain? Joel Selwood is the captain of the Shinboners. And they do go into this match with a higher overall rating. Losing Jaeger O'Meara dropped us to a 78 overall instead of a 79. Just goes to show how much a role players can play. In their designated teams. Very keen to see this series continue. A lot of you have been reaching out saying you want to see some different fantasy series going on. I might even have something in the works involving some other people as well. So very keen to start doing this type of thing on a more regular basis here on the channel. Because I'm finding it very enjoyable. It mixes up the balance... It makes all teams pretty much equal along the board, I feel, as well. But the roof is closed at Marvel Stadium. We all know what it's called. Dylan Grimes, Jeremy Howe, Phil Davis, Heath Grundy, Scott Thompson, Mark Bagley. They've got a good defensive line. Gary Rowan. They've got some good players, North Melbourne. Defensively, they're probably the strongest defense we've come across to date. But that being said, we've probably got one of the most potent forward lines that they've taken on as well. Here come our Tigers. Performing a lot better than the Tigers in real life, I can assure you of that. Here comes North Melbourne. Nathan Jones in there. So they've got an alright midfield group. If they've got Nathan Jones and Joel Selwood in the midfield, that's a very good core, tough unit. To say what you will about Joel Selwood, I he might, you know, roll his shoulders and duck his knees to get the free kicks, but he is a very courageous player in a lot of other retrospects. Get into him, Sicily. Zach Tui getting stuck into an unknown player over there. Maddie Nichols, the bald headed flog to ball it up. Contest won by Max Gorn. North Melbourne, however, easy with the handball. They're going to score first, North. They're going to hit the post. That was way too fast for my liking. We could be in big trouble if that's how quickly and smoothly they're going to move this ball. McDonald plays on, takes it long to halfback. Sam Gilbert takes an uncontested grab. Off hands. We've got a contest. 
Richmond run the ball out. Nathan Jones goes for a chip kick. No prior. Paul Popolo, ball up. Max Gorn should have the better of the ruck contest here. Richmond with numbers. Pushing the back against Thompson. Caddy's just going to pump it long inside 50. Charlie Curnow uncontested. He's going to make sure of this one, Kerno. And he puts it through the middle. Richmond out. Five point lead early. But that's not going to mean much at the moment. North Melbourne with the ball. No prior opportunity, however. Ball up inside 50 for North Melbourne. Off hands. Max Gorn, handball to nobody. Might be able to follow it up here. No, he doesn't. Kick off the deck. Manic ball. North Melbourne with numbers. Toby Green. Will line up to put North Melbourne in front. And he makes sure of it. Richmond, one goal straight, six. Trails North Melbourne, one one seven. North Melbourne by a point early in the first term. Dustin Martin's there. He gets the handball off as he's tackled. Max Gorn tries to get the handball off. North Melbourne run away with the ball. Sam Gilbert's got it. Inside 50. And he has hit Josh Dunkley. He pops it up to the top of the goal square. And that's a goal. Jeremy Cameron. I thought I did enough to spoil that ball there, but North Melbourne now out to a seven-point lead. 2-1-13, plays one straight six. And they are just running rampant at the moment, North Melbourne. Jeremy Cameron's looking for goal number two. No, he's passed it off. Off hands. Oh, what have I done? What have I done? Hand passed it straight to Jared Waite, who's just gone back and went whack. 3 1 19, plays one straight six. Oh, we're in trouble. Bailey Dale inside 50, Jeremy Cameron again. Well within his range, but he's missed it to the near side. McDonald brings it in, he goes long. Good mark there by Sam Doherty. He moves it out long, half forward. Good take by Jordan Degoe. He's got a target inside 50. He pokes it in that direction. But it's cut off by Dylan Grimes in defence. Mark Bagley has it. Moves it out to the centre wing. Off hands. We're going to have a throw in. Wow. 14 point deficit. We've got to do something to come back here. North Melbourne with plenty of numbers around the ball. Diving mark from Tim Membry. Chips it up. Off hands. Richmond with numbers. North Melbourne has it. Handball over the top. They've gone for goal. Membry has kicked another one and the floodgates are starting to open for North Melbourne. 4-2-26, plays one straight six. North Melbourne by 20 points. Dustin Martin just pokes the ball up. Taken on the chest, uncontested by Scotty Thompson. And Richmond down by 20 points at quarter time. Who would have thought this was coming? Wow. Wow. Most possessions on the ground, all by our defensive line. Richmond have to lift here. North Melbourne came out, shocked to the system. That's too high, Archie Smith. Clayton Oliver moves the ball long in the Petrarca direction, who's taken it, very clean hands. Chips the ball up forward. Good tackle there by Bruce Josh Caddy. He's going to miss. He's going to miss the whole lot. Out on the full. Josh Caddy. 
Chipping ball inside. Luke Bruce. Go back and kick it. Oh, Bruce. He's special. He gets his first. But most importantly, he stems back that lead. 4 2 26 plays two straight 12. North Melbourne by 14 points. That's all this game's about at the moment. Couple of quick goals on the board, and we are back in this contest. But North Melbourne storming out of the middle. Sam Gilbert's got it. Moves it inside 50 slightly. Tim Membry moves to the forward pocket, and he's found Toby Green, who will look at putting them back up by 20. And he has done just that. North Melbourne with all the answers here. 5-2-32 plays two straight 12. 20-point lead North Melbourne's way. And they're going to storm out the middle again here. Off hands. Big contest. Delivered out of bounds against Tim Membry. Thank God for that because nothing else is going our way. Gary Rowan has taken it half forward. He's moved it out laterally and he's hit James Sicily. Lace out. Sicily goes long to the wing. Max Gorn takes a big grab. Pumps it up just inside forward 50. Who's there? Richmond with plenty of numbers. Caddy has it. Pops it up for Kerno. Off hands again. North Melbourne storm out with ease. Gary Rowan has it. Moves it to centre wing. He's found Jack Rewalt. Rewalt chips it up. Plenty of Richmond numbers around that ball to lock it down. It's going to be a throw up on the centre wing. Max Gorn wins the tap. Dustin Martin's there. North Melbourne, however, with the numbers. They chip it up forward. Sicily cuts it off again. Good couple of minutes from Sicily. Oh! Big grab from Pawapolo. Piss off. It's going to be charging against Max Gorn, apparently. Chipping it up to half forward. That's not charging, though. Get around that. Inside 50. Off hands. Plenty of Richmond numbers. Can we work it out? Nope, no advantage at all. Maxi Gorn just pops it up. Forward pocket. Joel Hamling. Contested grab. That was actually a very good grab. Mark Bagley has it. Turns it over to Josh Caddy, and he's going to go back and have a shot. He needs to stem the flow. He's brought it back. Josh Caddy. He's kicked his first. 5-2-32 plays three goals straight. 18 North Melbourne by 14 points. Dustin Martin's got it. Chips the ball up to his mate Caddy. Turn around, kick inside again. Dustin Martin's been taken too high. No, it's not Dustin Martin. It's Bruce. Bruce is going for number two. Oh, he has miffed the kick, but he has put it through. Bruce. He's kicked his second. 5 2 32 plus four straight. 24 North Melbourne by eight points. North Melbourne with possession of the ball. Off hands. Gorn chips it inside. 50. Hits Petrarca on the chest. To bring it back to two points. He has put it to the top of the goal square instead. Ladies and gentlemen, that is your halftime siren. Richmond have managed to bring the deficit back from a 20-point quarter time deficit to eight points at halftime. Scott Thompson and Joel Selwood lead the way with seven possessions each. Josh Caddy leads the way for Richmond with five. Big half ahead. North Melbourne seem to have the answers every single time we score. They score back even harder. Clayton Oliver's got it. Handballs it straight to North Melbourne. Dusty hand passes it to nobody in particular. Where's the Richmond numbers? There they are. North Melbourne's going to work it out with hands. That's throwing the ball. 
Clayton Oliver's going to chip it up. I thought Bruce was all over that, but Dylan Grimes takes it, moves it into the middle. Max Gorn. Nice grab out in front. Puts it up for Kurno, and he's taking it on the chest. This to bring it back to two points. He's done it! Kurno goes bang! He's kicked his second. 5 2 32 plays five straight 32 point lead North Melbourne's way. Can Richmond continue this momentum? That is the question. Dusty's got it. North Melbourne with hands. Move it up to half forward. Sam Gilbert. Chipping ball. Josh Dunkley. Very good smother there by Zach Tui. Richmond have plenty of numbers around the ball, but North Melbourne get the inside 50. They're going off the deck. Membry's pushed it to the right. It's now a three-point ball game. McDonald just pumps it out long. Angus Brayshaw takes it at half back. Should have been Sicily's ball, but for some reason, Bailey Dale's managed to take it. Anyway, regardless, inside 50. Jacob Wiedering. He's not going to have a shot on goal. He's going to actually kick it outside of the forward 50. North Melbourne killing a lot of time, just chipping the ball around here. They've gone inside. Jacob Wittering now has it again. And the shot on goal is good. Nine point lead to North Melbourne. Max Gorn wins the ruck contest. Oh, come on. Chipping ball out to the wing. North Melbourne have a loose man out. They go to centre half forward. Archie Smith has it. Chipping ball inside. Off hands. There's plenty of North Melbourne numbers, but Richmond managed to work it out temporarily. No prior opportunity. Ball up just inside North Melbourne's forward 50. Max Gorn wins the contest. Dusty turns it straight over to North Melbourne. Phil Davis down injured. Not good for North Melbourne. Big clearing kick. Luke Bruce. Chips it up to Kerno. Turns it over to Joel Hamling. Could have potentially just gone for goal there himself, Luke Bruce. Get a little bit more distance. Throw in. Gorn wins the tap. That's going to be too high. Tom Mitchell puts it to centre half forward. Heaney's there. So is Petrarca. Richmond with numbers. That's going to be holding the ball against Tom Mitchell. And Tom Mitchell's been injured. Well, stay tuned for the developments of that. Tom Mitchell currently off the ground. Jack Graham has come on to fill the slot. Good defensive grab there from McDonald. He moves it out to half back. Now it's a leg race. Heaney, good little flick up there. Inside 50. Diving mark by Scott Thompson. Josh Caddy. Pretty much on the siren. Oh, that's going to go long. Oh, piss off. There is no way. They've marked it on the line. North Melbourne head into the final term. Nine points in front. We have a ball game on our hands. Scott Thompson is out to nine possessions. Playing at centre half back. Final quarter, everything on the line. No ifs, no buts. Everything has to come out here. Max Gorn's got it. Goes inside 50. Kerno direction. He's taken it lace out. Kerno's looking for his third. He has put it through. Back to three points. Richmond with all the momentum early. Good kick off the deck there by Dusty to get Mead Rich. Oh, Dusty, come on. 
If there's any man that can stand up and slot a clutch goal right now, it is Dustin Martin. Menegola moves it inside forward 50. He has found Jordan Dugowie. He's pushed it to the near right. Two-point ball game. North Melbourne bring it in. Off hands. Plenty of Richmond numbers. That's a push in the back. Angus Brayshaw is going to have a shot on goal. Just pops it up. Jeremy Howe takes it uncontested. Moves the ball out to the wing. Dustin Martin's got it. He just pops it straight back in the same direction it came from. Petrarca. And Richmond have taken the lead. After an absolute arm wrestle, Richmond finally back in front. 6-3, 39, play 7-1, Four points Richmond's way. Dustin Martin's now down injured as well. That's about right. That's going to be a push in the back against Sam Menegola. Come on, North, touch the ball. Zach Tui is there. Ball spills out in the tackle. It's going to be a throw in. Just shy of the half forward line for North Melbourne. Archie Smith wins that. Plenty of North Melbourne numbers around the ball. That should have been deliberate, umpire. Richmond need to get another just to be sure. Just to be certain. Get there, Stuart. Good clearing kick by Richmond. Jack Graham. Puts it up for Caddy. Caddy's looking for him. He pops it out to the pocket. Taken by Dylan Grimes. Dugowie's got it again. Sends it back inside 50. Caddy's there. Gorn's there. Richmond need to work it out here. Handball over the top. Handball to Petrarca. Petrarca! Christian Petrarca again. Pretty much seals the deal. Two kicks. Two goals. Richmond by 10 points. North Melbourne with the handballs out. Shot on goal. And they stem it back again. They are still within touch. 45 plays 49. Four points. This is not only the closest game we've had in this series so far. But it is also the biggest comeback we have had so far. 20 points down at quarter time to be four points up late in the final term. One more goal at this point. Pretty much wraps it up. Josh Caddy! Caddy's kicked it! That's the ball game. Kangaroo 7-3-45. Richmond 9-1-55. 10 points. High tackle against Jeremy Cameron. He's just going to pop it over the top here to Caddy. Why not? Why not let Caddy have another shot? It's going to fall short. Bruce is going to take the mark, but it's going to be all for naught. Richmond with a huge comeback win. Absolutely incredible scenes at Marvel Stadium, ladies and gentlemen. Wowzers. That was impressive. What a good contest. However, ladies and gentlemen... That is going to wrap up this episode of AFL Evolution Fantasy Series. Thank you for joining me. As always, I am so keen to keep playing this for you all. And I want to thank you all so much for getting behind this series. If you have been enjoying it, go ahead and leave a like on the video. It goes a long way to supporting myself. I seriously cannot thank you guys enough for all that support. 
If you are new to the channel, plenty of other content to check out. I urge you to do so. If you enjoy what I'm throwing down, hit that subscribe button. Pledge your allegiance to the gods of nation. Sam Gilbert gets best on ground, but Josh Caddy and Charlie Curno sneak in the votes as well. Can't be too upset with that. If you guys want to see anything different from AFL Evolution, be sure to let me know in the comment section down below. It could be anything. If you want to see listed player series, if you want to see a coach career series, which I still have that vote open for which teams you would like to see me take control of next. I've let it go for a little bit because I want to make sure everybody gets involved with that. And there are some front-running teams that I think a few of you might be surprised with. Social media links are down below. Be sure to hit that notification bell before you leave as well so you get notified every single time a brand new video hits the channel. But that's it from me, guys. I'm out of here. And as always, I will catch you guys next time.